What's good YouTube, it's your boy Mike Mitchell in the building and here is the official Chevy Sim Unlock. Um, if you didn't check out that one video I made about the unboxing, go ahead and click right up here. That is the unboxing. Um, so let's get down to business. Um, the Chevy Sim runs you for about $35 from Apple and Barry. Um, by the video, you can check that out. Like I said, you can get it for $13 and this is no cu cutting. Be careful, on Am it's on Amazon, but be careful. Um, make sure you choose the link that I told you because you can get a replica. This is a fake. This one does not work. It's a piece of garbage. But as you can see here, I got the um, official Appleberry um, Jevy Sim for only $13. So be sure to check out that video. So let's get down to business. This will unlock pretty much every iPhone, every firmware, and hopefully uh, future firmware. You do not need to be jailbroken for this. Um, it's a simple task. Um, I might add, you definitely want to invest in one of these. This is a, if you don't have a micro sim, because it runs you about $9 right there. They came out with a new black one. It's pretty nice, so you can check that out. So let's get down to business. Here's in my SIM card is stuck. Oh no, this ain't good. There we go. Just my luck. Pop this bad boy out. So what you do is put your uh, Jeffy SIM in here and you're going to put your SIM card on top of that. And as you can see, this is no cutting. Everybody else has the cutting, the $35 one, so make sure you get this. You don't have to cut. What we're going to do is insert it in the phone. See, it clips right in there. Make sure you power the phone off. Turn the phone right back on. There we go. We're going to slide. And then you're going to click accept. And you're going to wait a couple seconds until you see um, service. It's about 15 seconds, I'm pretty sure. Then we're going to go into phone, keypad, you're going to dial 1, 1, 2, you're going to hit call, don't let it connect, count for 2 seconds, 1, 2, you cancel that, close out of this, then go into settings, as you can see we have airplane mode, you're going to turn that on. I'm just going to let the phone do its thing until it says, uh, no SIM watch. Take about 45 seconds. And there we go. We're going to turn it off. SIM failure. Wait a couple seconds. And boom, baby. Oh, I know you saw that T-Mobile. What the heck just happened? Hmm. Okay, we're right back in business. Um, my bad. I, I guess it's better for me to make a mistake on camera so you guys can see what can possibly happen. Two wrongs don't make a, a right. It's Mike Mitchell TV. So I clicked up accept. We're going to run through the steps again. If it doesn't work the first time, you power off your phone and we're going to go through the process again. So we're going to wait for the service to show up. There we go. Go back in the phone. 
that one one two call one two now we're gonna end the call go back into settings turn airplane mode right back on and we'll do it a second time Like I said, you gotta wait 45 seconds, or until it says um, sim failure or something like that. No sim, sorry. No sim card installed. Anyway, sorry y'all. Um, like I said, here you go. Here's the T-Mobile um, jailbroken device on the iPhone 4, 4.3.2, Baseman 0.4. Um, uh, everybody's freaking out about this me showing y'all my stuff my IPSW I don't know I don't know what the big deal is but I ain't trying to show it so as you can see the modem firmware is zero Point ten, whatever you already know, but this is Mike Mitchell TV. Hope this video helped you out. Um, deuces. Leave a comment if you uh, are having troubles with the booklet, cause this booklet kind of sucks. So I had to do this about three times to figure it out. But Jeffy Sim, Mike Mitchell TV. I'm deucing out. Please like this video and uh, rate, subscribe, and do what you gotta do. Um, Mike Mitchell TV. Two wrongs don't make a right.